AI is just really bad at calculating numbers. For example, I asked perplexity what is the answer of 83,400 multiplied by 1,234. And according to the GPT 4.1 model, which is the model I use for this demo, this is the answer, 102,855,000. And unfortunately, that is wrong because the correct number is this one. This is the correct answer if you're using just basic calculation. And this problem is not unique to GPT 4.1. Pretty much all L models like GPT, Gemini, Cloud, Mistral, etc. They do suffer from the same problem because they are large language models not designed for calculation. Let me give you another example. This is a problem or riddle that I passed on cloud for net and basically it gave me this answer. Susan and Lisa played 8 games in total but again that is wrong. The actual answer is 11 games. So this could be very challenging for anyone that wants to use perplexity AI to get an accurate answer when asking a math problem. But luckily, there is a workaround that you can try to ensure that AI will give you the most accurate answer. So let me give you one example. Let's go to perplexity.ai and I'm going to be using the same problem again. Let me just copy this and let's paste that right here. So there is an instruction that you can try to force AI to calculate deeply before giving the answer. This is the prompt that you can try. Don't worry, I'm going to leave the full prompt in the video description. And let me just add a new line and paste the instruction. So uh, the instruction or the prompt is solve the math problem by breaking it down into clear step-by-step -step instructions. Show your reasoning at each stage to ensure that you arrive at the correct answer. And then you are and you can encourage AI to use Python to calculate the number. So in case you didn't know, there is a feature in Perplexity that uh, lets AI to, to use Python when trying to calculate some numbers. And I think it's very useful to ensure higher accuracy. Now I'm going to use, let's say, GPT 4.1 again. And let's disable web search. I, I just don't want AI to be influenced by third party answer. Just use, you know, the raw power of AI. Send a message and you'll see that it will give you much more accurate number. And finally, this is the answer. 102,915,600, which is exactly the correct number if you're using a calculator. So that's one technique that you can try. You can use this prompt to force AI to give you the, the best answer. But another, uh, another technique that you can try is by using a reasoning model. So I'm going to be copying this problem again and you can use one of the available original models in perplexity let me just paste that here you can select either you know r1 o3 or cloud for ozone thinking and usually original models are much much better at calculation because after all they are reasoning they will think very very thoroughly before giving you the answer it, it doesn't matter what model you're using i think all of them are very good but i think right now the best reasoning model at the moment is o3 from OpenAI. but feel free to use any model or reasoning model that is available on your perplexity account and let me send a message and you will see that it will think really really hard and it will give you the number that's most likely to be much better than regular model okay still thinking i guess or maybe there is a, a bug in perplexity okay let me refresh the page okay it could happen but trust me it has nothing to do with the question i believe it is just a bug in perplexity yeah it can happen sometime let me try it again and let's disable web make sure that it is all three and send the message Okay, this is, I believe this is a perplexity problem. Okay, oh, there you go. Finally, this is the answer, 102,915,600. So uh, that's definitely a much more accurate answer than this one. So that's the two techniques that you can try to force AI in perplexity to be more accurate at giving you a logic or math problem answer. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video.